After seeing my clients today, I just felt moved to make this video because we've been through so much. We've given up so much of what we thought we knew and that which gave us comfort and security and being left to find a new way. And we often forget how supported we truly are because we fight for independence and we fight to prove that we can, that we're strong enough, and that we can do it alone. And we miss the purpose of allowing ourselves to be supported, to be nurtured and cared for. And how often we forget to just ask for that which we need. And when I put an inspiration like that on Facebook, then people answer often that, but they asked and they don't receive. So, you know, we complicate things. Of course we could ask for money. Of, co of course we can ask for uh, the job or the house. But we need to simplify because when we ask for for, for the money or the job or the house or, or the partner, we, we often miss what is at the core of it. What do we need? What is our basic core needs? And often the need for money is just the need for peace, the need for a calm life, the need for joy. And the angels always say to me, if you pray and ask for peace and happiness, then you incorporate everything. Because if you pray for the experience of peace and joy, then you will have the money, you will have the health, you will have the time, you will have a fulfilling job. But we often cannot believe in that. So we constantly need to ask them for those experiences. And like I've told often before, when I came to a space in my life where I knew that I didn't have joy, I also knew that I couldn't ask for joy because I didn't know what it felt like anymore. So I started to ask the angels to give me the experience of joy again. And of course, God has a sense of humor. Spirit has a sense of humor. And I, got, I received my first wolf as a gift. And as soon as I started playing with him on the grass and I was rolling around on the, on the grass and laughing like a little girl, I knew this is joy. God is trying to show me what it feels like so that I can believe in it for myself. And in miracles, I mean, a wolf, who could have thought? It was certainly not what I prayed for. So allow yourself to just do that. Just try that. I know often it feels like praying doesn't work because we don't receive the answers. We don't receive what we think we need. But simplify. Go back to your basic core need. And we all need joy and we all need peace. So even if you just ask for that, that is something that we can believe in. Because often if you ask for money or to be cured from a disease or something, the mind is already obstructing and saying, but how's it going to happen? It can't happen. It can't just happen like that. So we're standing in our own way. But when you simplify it and you just ask for that peace and that tranquility and that joy to experience life, that's something that you know you are allowed to have. So go back to that and try that. I had that same experience myself because we are going through difficult times. So I was feeling very lost, useless, that I'm not amounting to anything. I felt that nobody understood me or wanted to support me or, you know, show up for my yoga or meditation. Nobody was interested. And I just asked the angel, show me that what was my actual words because I know to not overcomplicate it. So I just showed them, asked them to show me that I am appreciated and that my work does have worth. 
and the people came to my door and it was shown. Sometimes we just need to ask, acknowledge that we need some acknowledgement that we are on the right path without trying so hard to make it happen. I think just enjoy what shows up. Trust your energy. Be focused on your energy and what you radiate onto earth and what it attracts to you. We worry too much about what others are doing and how successful they are, how many followers they have, how many people they have in their classes or the kind of retreats they organize, whatever. And that's not your truth. Be 100% in what you do and stop focusing on what others do. And the more you just focus on the simplicity of being there for yourself, showing up, being aware of the way you live and create your pure intentions, the more your life will evolve. And it doesn't matter if we get stuck sometimes in the earthly judgment and needing acceptance and all of that. It's just showing us to just pull back again, retreat into what makes sense for you at your core. And you will find joy in that. I hope this helps you today. I'm sending you lots of love and remember you can share my videos with everyone that you think needs it and will be willing to listen. Lots of love to you.